Air pollution in the Middle East is a silent killer. Major cities like Tehran, Cairo and Riyadh are choking under a haze of pollutants. Industrialization, increasing populations and traffic congestion are the main culprits. Vehicle emissions, industrial activities, construction and burning fossil fuels for energy production are all significant contributors. But it's not just human activities. Natural factors like dust storms and sandstorms also contribute to poor air quality. Countries like Iran, Saudi Arabia and Egypt are among the worst affected. The health impacts are severe. Respiratory diseases, cardiovascular problems and other health issues are rampant, especially among children, the elderly and those with pre-existing conditions. Tehran, the capital of Iran, often tops the charts as one of the most polluted cities in the Middle East. Surrounded by mountains, it traps pollutants, making the air even more unbreathable. Vehicle emissions, industrial activities and power plants are the main sources. Cairo and Riyadh follow closely behind. In Cairo, vehicle emissions, industrial activities and burning agricultural waste wreak havoc on the air quality. Riyadh, dealing with rapid urbanization, struggles with pollution from vehicles, dust storms and industrial activities. Efforts to combat air pollution include stricter emission standards, promotion of renewable energy and investment in public transportation. International cooperation and regional partnerships are crucial to effectively tackle the issue. But despite these efforts, the battle is far from over. Continued action and investment are needed to improve air quality and protect public health. Air pollution in the Middle East is a silent killer, but it doesn't have to be. Together we can make a difference.